what is up my beautiful people welcome back to another video with your girl Pamela Janani welcome back to my channel what is the vibe my beautiful tribe happy Friday happy Friday my beautiful people so guys if you guys are not subscribed to my channel please go ahead and do so right now support your girl on this journey that I always say is bigger than me because it is all right absolutely is darling okay so I guys I love you all right um I have a few videos today, more than a few, but I want you guys to understand that you are so, so amazing, that you are winning, and there's a lot of people out there who wanna make you think otherwise, okay? One, you are winning because you're alive, you're breathing, okay? And you made it through all these things that people have tried to throw in front of you. You made it, you're here, all right? You're here. So God is telling me that you are a winner, that you made it, you are making it, and don't allow anybody else to tell you otherwise, okay? So with that being said, this video, okay, they try to alter your heart. A lot of people, when I say they, I'm talking about the people who are against you, your enemies. I'm talking about the negative, unjust people of the world. They want to alter your heart. They want to alter our hearts. Okay, let's tap into this video. Um, let's go. Um, people want to alter your heart. Many people are cold, cruel, and vicious because of their trauma. A lot of people are going through something because of something that they have went through. They're in this, this state of mind because of the trauma that they experienced back in the day. And they want to place you right in front of them. They want to make you the target so that they can feel good about themselves, so they can feel good and push their trauma away. This is how people operate, right? They feel pain. They want all to feel pain. They're upset. They want everybody else to be upset. Do you know what I'm saying? If you're not... Um, sugarcoating what they do, then they, they automatically think that you are against them because you're not stroking their hair and telling them that, you know what, what you're doing is, is right. And you know it because you are not agreeing to what they do, what they say, how they treat people, how they are not connected to God, then that means you are the enemy to them because people who are, are, have this God complex, they don't want to believe that there's a God who's going to bring down the karma, bring down the, the wrath and, and, and give them consequences to their actions. They don't want to believe that. They want to believe that they're in control of their lives and that nobody can do anything about it. When God can't, let's tap into this message some more. Frenemies, people who were um, friends, lovers, they try to purposely alter your heart. A lot of the people that we have encountered who have hurt us really, really purposely tried to alter our heart. I got people who I loved absolutely with all my heart and they wanted me to turn cold just as they are. So when you're having a, for me, as I said before in another video, I've always been this type of girl, woman, where if you're upset with me, you're angry at me, you are yelling and you just, ah, and, and you know what I do? And I didn't do this because I wanted to trigger them. I did this because this is this has always been who I am. I had this one woman who was who was in my life, who I loved dearly, right? And that day she wanted so badly for me to be upset. So she picked an argument with me. She was upset about something that had nothing to do with me. A lot of our enemies are upset and they're mad at us when it has nothing to do with us. It's them and their choices. So this one particular time, this person who I love, okay, was upset at me for something very, very small. For I mean, I'm just gonna tell you, because I, I took a DVD from her home, from her daughter's room. I took it home and I watched it, okay? And she was mad because I took the DVD and, and, and I didn't tell her, which I didn't think I had to tell her. I just literally just, this lady never watched the DVDs. And, and, and matter of fact, you know, I wasn't young, but I was young. Okay, so I took your DVD, I brought it back and, 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 and she got mad at me. She got real, real nasty with me. Okay, and she wanted to actually throw hands. She wanted to throw hands. And I had my little girl hold, I was, my little girl was probably like four at the time and I was holding her hand and this woman wanted to throw hands because I took a DVD home to watch it and brought it back. She wanted to throw hands. So in the meanwhile, she's yelling and she's upset and she see, she's watching me and I'm not giving her the energy that she wants. I'm not, I'm not exchanging, the, I'm not taking this energy in and I'm not going to exchange it, okay? She tried to alter my energy. She tried to alter my mood. She tried to control my narrative of how I was going to go about my day after I parted ways from her. She wanted to ruin my day. She wanted to alter my heart. They want to alter our hearts, right? So I smile. She's yelling and I was like, Okay, are you done? Are you done? I'm gonna leave, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave and you can keep that energy right there where you are and I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna take my little girl while you're trying to attack me physically and, and emotionally. I'm gonna take my little girl, I'm gonna go. 
And this is how I've always been. I don't let people ruin my energy. I don't have time for that. And now that I'm standing in my power with God and so much more now, I really don't have time for that. I don't want to argue with you. I don't want to entertain your demonic behavior. I'm going to smile. I'm going to wish you peace. And I'm going to walk in peace. You know what I'm saying? And this is how God is telling me to tell you guys to walk. Walk in peace because a lot of people are going to try to alter your heart. Because they want you to be in the same state of mind and the same position that they're in. Well, let's tap into it some more. So they do things to hurt you so that you turn cold. Karma attaches to us very, very quickly. Karma attaches to me and you, to everyone that is living in this world very, very quickly. You do something good, that karma is automatically attached to you. You do something bad, that karma is automatically attached to you. And when it, it comes back to you, I don't know. It can be that same day. It can be whenever God says, it's time for you to pay your karma, good or bad. Do you know what I'm saying? And for a lot of our enemies, as I said before in another video, a lot of the karma that they are getting right now is coming instantly because they have done too much to you. They have done too much to me. They have done too much to God's people. And the karma is attaching the same day. There is no more. I'm waiting to see if you're going to change to be a better person. It's the time is now. You are going to reap what you have sown. Absolutely. All right. Let's get going here. Um... The consequences can show up that day or years years later on, okay? Whenever God says he sees fit. All depends on when God and his team, the universe, angels, says so. Of course, God is number one. But God, the universe, and, and, and nature, everything works with God. Every, this is all God's. And the, and the beautiful thing about this world is that when you're walking with God, the universe is with you. When you're walking with God, the angels are with you. Everybody is with you. And guess what? As you and I know, they're all good. That's, that's beautiful. Um, we are never to change who we are as a reflection to someone else. This person that I was, you know, engaged with that time, not, but you know, talking to, wanted me to, to, to change myself, wanted me to step outside of who I was, my energy to match theirs. We're not matching anything like that. We're not doing that, right? No. Once you allow someone to alter your words, your action, your mind, they got you. They got you. Once you allow someone to alter anything about you, they have got you. Not saying that they got you forever, but they've got you. Okay? We are not to be gotten. Mm -mm. Then they will try to pull you in and watch you unravel. Your enemies, the enemies of the world, they want to see good people. They want to see us unravel so that they can say, okay, I told you so. Being bad is cool. Being bad can get you somewhere real fast. Being bad can get you somewhere fast, but it can also make you drop real fast. Their intention, their, um, their intention, okay, is for you to be in pain, as I said before. Receive the karma that they can't release. A lot of people are walking around and they've done so many nasty and wicked things and they've got so much karmic debt that they want you to be a part of it because they feel like there's no, they, they can't release it. You know what I'm saying? And karmic debt, good or bad, it doesn't go anywhere. It doesn't go anywhere. We got to pay it off. Um... They want you to be um, experience their karma because they keep repeating the same pattern that they are afraid to break. A lot of our enemies, I said before, they walk around like they're so tough and they are afraid. They are afraid to to face their karma. They're afraid to face their trauma. And when you are afraid to afraid to face your karma and your trauma, nothing good can happen. Nothing good can come from that. And they're afraid. Um, so they in in, in order for them to um, handle the you know them being fearful they 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 boost up their ego this is why a lot of our enemies have a huge huge ego a god complex because that is the only way that they can see themselves um uh, as being a warrior and strong and protective because they know deep down inside that they're not they're afraid to fight their battles so they want to create battles for other people message is to remain calm rest your heart with god people are going to try you People are going to try you every single day and night. Not every single day and night. Uh -uh, no, thank you. We're not going to speak that, okay? But they will try you. I am going to be tried. You're going to be tried. Tomorrow, next year, two years, you're going to be tried. And God is saying to remain in peace, remain calm, okay? For some of you guys watching, you you may experience something this weekend that someone is going to try to tip you off and make you upset. God is saying don't fall into it. I don't know who that's for, but don't fall into it. Get loud with your actions and not with your words. And when God says get loud with your actions, be at peace. 
let people see peace when they look at you let them see peace and they can either learn from that they can even gravitate towards that and see how and ask you how are you doing it watch how you're doing it try to get some of that or they can be hateful and that is when you say deuces see you later okay you know what i'm saying get lost and this is not a get lost i'm 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 a a negative person or I'm uppity this is a get lost because I don't deserve what you're trying to bring towards me do you know what I'm saying your energy belongs to you and not them and that is it for this video okay I love you guys so much be sure to like comment and subscribe give your girl a thumbs up okay tap that thumbs up button right now okay subscribe to my channel I love you guys so much I'm wishing you nothing but love light and abundance and I'll see you guys in the next message be sure to check them out okay bye